So back in uh, May 12, 2008, when I was much younger, uh, I was only 37 back then, I decided to go ahead and write Bacardi a letter, and um, I wrote them this letter. Bacardi, 2100 Biscayne Boulevard, Miami, Florida, 33137-5028. Dear Bacardi, I am a sucker for good graphic design. Your bat logo practically puts me in a swoon. Once, I bought six bottles of your rum just to get a full set of bat device glasses. That was a long weekend, let me tell you. I've been a loyal drinker of your rum since I was 17. I don't tell anyone. I'm now nearly 38, and I still love the stuff. Recently, I swore off Coke for a year, and I just don't dig Bacardi and Pepsi. Thus my dilemma. Could you suggest a good recipe for a great cocktail? I wear a size extra large shirt and would love a bat shirt. In fact, I'd go positively downright bat shirt crazy if you sent me one. Sorry about the bad pun. If you don't have any shirts to give away, I'd dig a poster or drink coasters or a blender or a coffee mug or something with your logo on it. Anything would be cool. I don't expect anything, but it would make my day if you sent me something free. Thanks. Christopher L. Jorgensen. And did Bacardi send me anything? No, they didn't. I got no love from Bacardi. See, even this shirt? This is what they call product placement, kids. Even this shirt, I had to get from my girlfriend. She was the only one who was going to show me any love. So, instead... I'm going to sit here, instead of being loved by Bacardi, I'm going to cut off all of my hair and drink. Sorry if that like messes with all you kids on YouTube watching this in 3D. I only do this because they won't let you take the rum into the barber shop, so, and, you know, 